I'm Scott Kennedy. I'm the trustee chair in Chinese business and economics at CSIS. And I'm delighted to be joined today by Scott Roselle, who's the co-director of Stanford's Center on China's Economy and Institutions, and the Helen F. Farnsworth Senior Fellow at the Freeman Spogli Institute for International Studies at Stanford. And Scott is my co-conspirator in what we call Big Data China, a collaboration between Stanford and CSIS to translate academic work into a language that policymakers can understand. The world knows that U.S.-China relations are important and U.S.-China relations haven't done well the last few years, to say the least. I always say, almost in a kidding way, it's, you know, 70% China's fault and 70% the U.S.'s fault to this, this problem. And and the 70% on the U.S. fault is a big, in a big, big sense, is because we just don't understand China. I think that if we understood China better, we could make better policy decisions and try to take out of this relationship what can really help us and help the world. Academia is somewhere between five and 10 years ahead of the policy community in terms of understanding what cutting edge research is. And I think as a result, policymakers sometimes are like astronomers. They're looking at the stars, which are history, not reality of today. I do think Washington, despite all the politics, partisanship, there is a genuine interest and desire to have facts and information and analysis and make good decisions. And so I'm delighted. And, and I really think this is important, the collaboration that we have you know, after some of our feature speakers have been on Big Data China, they then engage with so many people around Washington. And it's really a give and take. You know, we want to know better what's going on, and that'll help us make better policies and, and better decisions. I hope everyone who's interested in what's going on in China and the scholarly work and what it means for public policy will follow Big Data China, give us feedback and help us uh, focus on the issues that matter.